You know, they have Snapchat, which a lot of the kids are very familiar with, and I use that because they automatically know um, that, oh, Snapchat, oh, it deletes the picture in, you know, two seconds, three seconds, whatever. You know, all I have to do is take a screenshot as soon as I get that picture, and it takes me less than a second to snap it if I know it's coming. Then I have that photo. Then I send it to my, to my friend in, you know, Facebook Messenger. Now it's in Facebook Messenger server, and it's on my device, and it's on their device. And so it, it just keeps going. It's, it's the snowball effect. Um, so once you do take that initial photo, put it in an app, and it just launches, it, you can't get it back. It is literally like lighting a stick of dynamite underneath and having an avalanche because it can be traded so fast. We've actually tested and you can get an image of child pornography around the world in just under four hours. So when a 16 year old girl takes a photo of herself to send to her boyfriend, a nude photo, um, and he violates the trust and sends it out to someone else, or she puts it on a website or whatnot. There's not a pedophile's computer I get on that I don't find those photos of the girl in the, you know, the high school student in the bathroom taking a selfie. They end up in Predator's hands. Um, I can't say always, but more often than not.